a spring break and the weather doesn't look perfect this weekend. It's not going to be awful though. Right now you're looking at some clouds increasing over the city of Tuscaloosa over West Alabama and that's pretty much the way the skies will look much of the weekend. Your weather headlines as we go forward now include the following much milder tonight. Be more comfortable outside. Few showers, especially late tomorrow and Sunday, but no severe weather this weekend. Looks like there's no threat of severe weather until at least the middle of next week, and that's far from a certainty. Right now on the WVTM 13 Live Doppler, your most accurate look at current conditions. No sign of any rain out there. If you're going out tonight, I don't think it's going to rain, and it's going to be pretty comfortable. 69 now in the Magic City, 71 Tuscaloosa. So temperatures have come up very nicely, and most of the time this weekend, it'll be fairly comfortable outside. Mild night ahead, 66 degrees at 7. Down to 62 at 9, about 58 degrees by 11 o'clock. So no matter how you look at it, not as chilly as it's been. Rain chances are certainly there both days this weekend, but they're not super high. 30% tomorrow, 50% on Sunday, and then we're just kind of bouncing around Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday with some chance of rain each day. At this point, we start off with clouds in place. We go through the overnight period, and that's pretty much what we have during the day tomorrow. Mostly cloudy skies with a little bit of sunshine. This model suggests uh, some light rain may get into our northwestern counties around 5 o'clock and kind of dance around the northern half of the area as we go through tomorrow night into Sunday. And then later Sunday, maybe just clouds once again. So not a perfect weekend, some rain but not a washout either. My forecast for tonight across the area and the next seven days. Tomorrow, partially sunny, po possibility of a shower, 75 the high, 72 on Sunday with a chance of showers. Maybe showers a bit more likely on Monday, and Monday will be a lot chillier, only in the upper 50s for highs. Just for one day, though, temperatures come back up after that. Kind of unsettled the second half of next week. The rainiest day looks to be on Thursday. Ian, sure.